Hello and a warm welcome from Biztrend Solutions. We're thrilled to show you the power of our service CRM. Get ready to transform your customer service experience. Let's dive in. CRM has two parts, a web app for managers, supervisors, and customers, and a mobile app designed for the service team. Our CRM is built with top-notch tech. We use PHP and CodeIgniter for the web app, MySQL for our database, and native Android development for the mobile app, a powerful combination. Welcome to our service CRM application demo. We're excited to start right here at the login page. Our application is designed to cater to a variety of users, including service managers, service supervisors, customers, etc. Service engineers and service supervisor uses mobile app to manage their activities. Please keep in mind, we're in our demo environment, so the data might not be exact. Ready to see more? Let's go. After logging in, we land on the dashboard. It's tailored to who you are, so what you see changes based on your role. As an administrator, like me right now, you get the full view, all team members right on your screen. Plus, you get a neat summary of service requests, installation needs, and preventive maintenance tasks. Let's take a closer look at how it organizes everything for us. Now, let's dive into the menus. Here, we've got everything you need to manage services smoothly. Service request management for keeping track of requests, expense management to oversee costs, master's management for core settings, and reports for insights. That's not all. We also have users for account settings and KPIs to monitor performance. There's so much to explore, so let's get into it. Let's check out the service request management next. Clicking here brings up all the service requests made today. Want to see something else? Easy, change the date or pick a dealer name to filter the data. Also, keep an eye on the status of each call. They're color-coded to make things super clear at a glance. Let's see how this helps us stay on top of everything. Now, let's click on the View button to dive into the details. In the first page, we see Dealer Info. In the second page, there is Call Details or Complaint Details. In the next page, we can see the track record of the call status. Next, depending on the call type, you might see an installation or service details. If the engineer used a spare part, that would be listed here. And if required, you can add a spare part right from the back end. Don't miss the images captured by the engineer. Wrapping up, we can generate a call report and, if needed, send it straight to our customer. But guess what? Customers can check these details on their own login as well. Let's see how this all comes together. Let's go ahead and add a new service request. First step, select the service type. We have five options here, installation, service or complaint, G-data, PM, preventive maintenance, and others. Choosing the right type helps us tailor the process and response to exactly what's needed. Let's pick one and move to the next step. Now, we'll enter the service request ticket number we received from the customer. Don't worry about our system's ticket ID. It generates automatically. Next step, enter the serial number and hit search. A list pops up, and from there, we pick the correct serial number. This simple action pulls in all the relevant details from the installation master. It's all about making the process quick and accurate, ensuring we have everything we need right at our fingertips. Let's select the right one and move forward. Now, let's type in the service request issue and hit save. As soon as we do that, the call gets notified to both the engineer and his supervisor. The engineer will then attend to the call directly from his mobile app. It's a seamless connection from issue reporting to on-the-ground action. All set, let's save and notify our team. Now, let's switch over to the mobile app. I'm entering my user ID and password, but that's not all. There's also OTP validation for an extra layer of security. Let's go through the login process. Here we are at the mobile apps dashboard. 
It's designed to give a quick snapshot of various key performance indicators, KPIs. You'll find insightful visuals like the under-norm versus over-norm donut chart, a comparison chart of service requests from last month versus this month, details on top spare parts consumption, and weekly expenses. It's all about giving engineers and supervisors the data they need at a glance to make informed decisions on the fly. Moving on, let's check out the new service requests. This section lists all the services assigned to the engineer. What's handy is that engineers can accept or reject calls based on factors like their working area, pending call capacity, and more. This feature ensures that engineers manage their workload efficiently, focusing on what they can handle best. Let's see how this system works to streamline their day-to-day -day operations. If an engineer decides to reject a call, the app requires them to specify the reason for this rejection. It's a straightforward way to ensure transparency and accountability. Once a call is rejected, it then becomes the supervisor's responsibility to reallocate the call to another engineer. This process helps in efficient task distribution and ensures that no service request is left unattended. When an engineer accepts a call, they need to enter a tentative closure time for the call and save this information. This step is crucial as it gives the customer a clear expectation of when their issue will likely be resolved. It's all about enhancing the customer experience by keeping them informed every step of the way. Now let's look at the service request list. This is where all pending calls are displayed, making it easy for engineers to see what needs their attention next. What's really helpful here is the quick filter feature, allowing for fast sorting through the calls by type. Plus, there's a count for each type of call, which helps in quickly assessing the workload and prioritizing tasks. This setup is designed to keep everything neatly organized and ensure that no call gets overlooked. Moving forward, let's explore the call validation, call history, and reference document sections in more detail. Call validation is an essential step where the service engineer engages in a conversation with the customer to understand and potentially resolve the issue over the phone. This approach aims to provide a quick fix or determine if the issue is complex enough to be forwarded to the technical help desk. THD team. Only when it's deemed absolutely necessary does the engineer proceed to visit the dealer location. This process ensures that resources are used efficiently and customer issues are resolved as swiftly as possible. In the call history section, engineers have a detailed view of all previous interactions, including the issues encountered and the solutions that were implemented. Thus, historical insight is invaluable. Before initiating call validation, reviewing the call history can significantly enhance the engineer's ability to understand and resolve the current issue more effectively. The reference document section is a resource hub for engineers, packed with PDF documents and instructional videos. These materials are specifically curated to bolster the engineer's knowledge and skills, providing them with a solid foundation to tackle a wide range of issues more effectively. Now, let's dive into call updation. After finishing the service, the engineer updates various details about the work done. This step is crucial for maintaining a transparent and complete record of the service provided. The process doesn't end there, though. To officially close the call, the engineer must gather a signature from the customer, along with a satisfaction code reflecting the customer's approval of the job done. This ensures that every service is concluded with clear customer feedback, marking the service as completed satisfactorily. While our service CRM application is packed with numerous features designed to streamline operations and enhance user experience, we've covered the essentials today. Remember, each feature is crafted to address specific needs within the service management process, ensuring efficiency and customer satisfaction. Although we won't dive into every feature right now, know that our system is built to support your service management goals comprehensively. Thank you for exploring these features with us. If you have any questions or if there's anything more you'd like to know, please feel free to get in touch with me.
If you're interested in this application or in need of similar process automation software development, you've come to the right place. We specialize in crafting solutions that streamline operations and enhance efficiency. With a deep understanding of process automation, we're equipped to develop software that meets your specific needs. With over 20 years of experience in the field, we bring a wealth of knowledge and expertise to the table. Our track record includes the successful completion of more than 120 customized ERP and CRM software projects. This vast experience ensures that we understand the unique challenges and requirements of our clients, enabling us to deliver tailored solutions that drive success. Let us know how we can assist you in achieving your automation goals.